Tights. Printed tights? Look at that time it takes to load. That's like, uh, that's like loading the Smash Brothers JPEGs. I did get this. This was a raid battle. I tried a couple of those. This was a three-star one. So I did end up going for it. And I got Tinkatuff. Is that what it's called? But it's a pink thing with a hammer. So obvious, obviously it's Amy Rose. I might use it. Fairy Steel is a neat combination. I also found a cave with Larvitar. Gotta use Lar Larvitar. I can't not use my little guy. What are you? It's Varum. I, I don't know if I can give it a better nickname than Varum. I kind of just like Varum. Hello. We found one. Or, well, we found two. Ah! Alright. It's tradition. I breed Pokemon. What, what is that? Why is there a ball there? Oh, that's... Hello, NPC trainer. Wow, you uh, you have a superpower. That's impressive. What's the name of your quirk? You're a trainer, Harry. Turn around. Turn around. Ignore me! Oh, go on. Get him. Def Ankle biter! All right, now that it is asleep, I'm going to cake both of its eyes with mud so that it will wake up disoriented and confused. Or I'll just fucking die. Scovillain. Is that, is that the evolved form of the pepper? That looks... <laughs> what a dumb looking Pokemon, I love it. I guess that's an advantage to fighting it twice. The second time you know what's good against it. So it's... Ground dragon type? That thing is not a dragon. Gleam is very offended at the suggestion. I don't know. There have been less dragon-looking things that are classified as dragons. The fucking cotton bird's a dragon. What is... Why Why was it so few polygons? Did we, did we see the low poly model when the battle started? Metatite sweat. Ugh. It never skips its daily yoga training. It heightens its inner strength through meditation. It's a smurf. I'm really sorry I couldn't battle you last time we ran into each other. But I didn't chase you down just to battle you. Not that I would mind a battle or anything. What do you say? Alright. I just have to I have to beat up a child in order to get the information I need. Look look at that pose! Look at that confidence. She She's gonna go on to do stuff. That's a future CEO. Santiago. I feel like I've run into a Santiago in this game. That's a great battle view. No, go back to the previous one. I, I like that camera. Oh. Wait, where did all those people go? Are they just continuing to eat underground now? Can you do that? They know what they're here for. They, they know what kind of building this is. I, d I don't know. We'll never know what happened to them because they didn't fucking bother animating it. Animation is expensive. You know, Nintendo's a small indie company. He's a salaryman. I like Larry. Here it is. This is what it looks like. It's... That's it? It's just dumb sparse but bigger. I thought it would turn into something cool. It's just a bigger dumb sparse. Are those people just under the arena right now? Feeling like the ceiling shake at every hit. Bit noisy, isn't it? Just, just rice balls. Just plain old boring, ordinary rice balls. Sorry, donuts. Oh, hello, tentacle hair. You look like the victim of an oil spill. You may be La Primera, but you can't go stealing my rival from me. Shut up, Kakarot! It's a fucking clown. It's It's got, like, sweet tooth hair and a flaming clown Ooh. nose. Why is it a clown? Yeah. I'm, I'm amazing. I've got so much potential. 
No one told Ash that. No one told Ash he was amazing, or had potential. They told him he was fucking worthless, and he was. But he worked hard. Veluza Filet. I'm sorry, did I cut off its flesh? When Veluza discards unnecessary flesh... Okay. Its mind becomes honed and its psychic power increases. The spare flesh has a mild but delicious flavor. Well, that's, uh... That's, uh humane way of saying that we eat this Pokemon, I guess. No, it, it it discards meat that it doesn't need anymore. You can eat it. it it's PETA approved. It's just gonna go to waste otherwise. Ernesto. He looks like an Ernest. Ernest becomes a Pokemon trainer. Sorry, let me, let me get at an angle that I can see you. Just kind of floating slightly off the ground there. Ernest gains psychic powers. Echo 2, the Tides of Time. It looks exactly the same, but it's got, like, bark. It's got tats. Oh. Oh, it's a superhero. It's a superhero dolphin? That's that's its gimmick? Is there anything, like, inherently steel about Tinkatuff? Or is it just a fairy with a hammer? Am I a steel type if I'm holding a hammer? Is that how that works? Clive, strolling in with his own theme music. He's got it playing on his iPod, his iPod shuffle he's got in his pocket that he bought in 2012. Still works. All right, let's let's see what uh, let's see what Super Dolphin can do. Wow, that looks stupid. I don't like that. People bullying you because you geek out over old-fashioned stuff. It's so majestic. It's, it, it's nice to know that there were uh, there were wild Crydon running around in the past a year and a half ago. We must maintain our vigils from the bases. Just hanging around. Like, they're trying to make this them seem noble, but they're just like fucking off doing nothing all day. They took over a random jungle. They've kicked everybody out. And they painted graffiti on all the trees, and they're not going to school. Final goal is to defeat the mastermind that first recruited the five bosses. The one they call the Big Boss. Yeah, who is Big Boss? They control five squad bosses from the shadows. That's all anyone can say, Snake! If we defeat this person and get them to declare the team disbanded, that'll be it for Team Star! That, uh, sounded like a pretty serious phone call. You sound familiar, Penny. Ghost Dog Pokemon. It is said that a dog Pokemon that died in the wild without ever interacting with a human was reborn as this Pokemon. Well, that's just sad. Fido. More like Fidun. Got him. It's both uh, male and female Pyroar. Very docile. You'd think it would be more dangerous in the world of Pokemon. To uh, be within, you know, 10 meters of a pack of lions. Given that they are not just lions, they're fire-breathing lions. But no, they're docile. They don't care. Alright. It is kind of cute. Gigaton Hammer. Can't be used twice in a row. 160 power, 100 accuracy, though. Alright, I'll, I'll stick with Amy for now. That's a, that's a nice move. 160 power. That, uh, that might have saved my opinion of this Pokemon. I still haven't evolved Olive. Olive has one more form, but you know what? I also kind of like her in that form. I kind of I kind of like her staying as Cosmo the Cedrian. There we go. Doesn't that just scream fighting type? Those tiny little arms? They're barely there. Interesting looking black belts in this gen. Wow, is it- was it just like floating on grass? That's impressive. I wanna get- I wanna get a close-up of that. Let me get closer. I wanna see its feet. Give me a Tarantino shot. My most nimble of rock pupas. This makes less sense than like Metapod and Kakuna. Because at most they have like tackle or poison sting. This pupa is supposed to be like flying around at supersonic speed, causing earthquakes and slicing things with with magic rocks. 
so beautiful, so graceful. Quaxwell. It looks like it's wearing a duck diaper. I'm never gonna run out of potions, am I? I'm gonna have these for the rest of the game. Doesn't matter how many I use. There's always gonna be more. Oh, it's like down a mountain is the Pokemon Center. I guess, is it in a giant hole? I think it is at the bottom of the crevasse. All right, well, away we go. It really is just at the bottom of a giant cliff. Why set up down here, though? What is your commute to work like every day? I love when we get to peek under the world like that. Did the children stay for ditto times? Don't, 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 we don't need to think about that. Let us not question how this Pokemon is born from an egg already existing in a pair. A pair which itself later fucks and produces children. This is, this is one of those Pokemon that the Pokemon company doesn't want you to think about. I'm sorry, what are you? It's a landfish. Katsugiri. Is this the pseudo? Th this isn't the pseudo legendary, is it? It's a dragon. When the Pokemon enters a battle, it goes inside the mouth of an ally Dodonzo if one is on the field. Okay. So it's specifically a doubles Pokemon that can only operate with one specific partner? That's stupid. What a stupid Pokemon. The never ending story. Da, 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 da. Oh, I'm falling. I'm falling. Was it even really a dragon? No, it wasn't before, but now. Now that it's piloted by a dragon, now it will become dragon. Much like how if you're holding a metal hammer, you become metal. It's just the way that the Pokemon universe works. Everything's gonna be alright. You're gonna survive. Say those fucking words. It's the feel-good film of the summer. I'm sorry, I'm, I'm ruining a... I, I guess it's a sweet moment. It's a very predictable moment in a children's game. Like, we knew, we knew this was where it was going. But uh, he gets to live with his ha his dog now. They're happy again. Good good for Arvin. Seems that Crydon has regained all of its powers except for power to battle. Should now be able to climb up any vertical surfaces it grabs on while you're riding on it. Press the B button to jump while facing a wall. I have unlocked Knuckle. Oh, he doesn't he doesn't like who I assume is his mother either. Arvin just doesn't really get along with anybody. I get, I get you're pent up, but I don't. your life doesn't seem that bad. Your dog just got better. You should be in a great mood. Even with your, like, weird caveman mom. Been researching the unique Pokemon here for a very long time. Asking the two of you to lend a hand to help carry out the final step of the great Professor Sada's glorious research. Okay, tone it down a little bit. Gather some reliable allies when you come. I'm, I'm sorry, we have to do, like, a, a raid? Like, we have to amass an army to go to this place. Also, we're, we're not, like, allowed to go there as students. We're breaking... Is the professor encouraging us to break school rules? We're gonna have a Pokemon bet. Oh, you and me? Oh, so you see if I'm ready or not. I know you're ready. Even if we always lost to that student council... She has a name, come on. You know her. It's Goku. Greedent is the glutton Pokemon. Is he just like uh, a whole team of food-themed Pokemon? Also, holy shit, Arvin, where were you? Were your Pokemon always this strong? Level fifty-eight? I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to come back to this. I didn't, I don't know why. I didn't expect the final boss of the Arvin route to be Arvin. He just, he always seemed like such a nice, like kind of a pushover. G G. Yeah, uh, Arvin, I think you're ready for Area Zero. I I might not be. Just uh, wait here. I'll be back. Maybe in like a week. 
I don't know if I can get through from this. Well, you know what? Yeah, I can now, because I have I have wall climbing ability. Thanks to the fact that I did that challenge, and the world is my oyster. I can just beeline anywhere I want. In fact, I'm gonna go to the cave one. I'm gonna fly to the bottom of a giant hole, and I'm gonna climb straight out. 